Now at 530, coronavirus cases continue to trend downward. That's welcome news for school officials in South Florida. Broward School Superintendent Robert Brunsey now says he is cautiously optimistic that children can get back into the classroom soon. CBS 4's Joe Murray has the latest developments. I want to open our schools as soon as possible. That's music to the ears of some Broward public school parents and kids anxious for a return to face-to-face -face learning. It's week two of online-only learning in Broward, but the downward trend in COVID cases hovering around 5% in recent days has prompted the superintendent's turnaround. If the current trends continue on the path of improvement, we could open sometime this fall. Again, I cannot guarantee or commit to any specific date as the path of the virus will drive the decisions we have to make. A key checkpoint for us to revisit our status will be after the Labor Day holiday. There hasn't been talk in a while about further lifting of restrictions in Broward because of recent virus spikes, but that could be changing if the infection and hospitalization rate keeps going down. We will have lab testing quality on site so that we can have results the same day as the test. Many Broward colleges like Nova Southeastern and Broward College are offering some in-class learning. We do have technical difficulties, but at the end of the day, we still have our resources, Canvas, Zoom, that we can use to get in contact with our teachers. And some teachers are still in person for office hours just with social distancing guidelines. These Nova freshmen live in a dorm and say there has been some over the line socializing, but they take the threat seriously. Serious situation. However, if you're not taking proper precautions, then it's really on you. It is difficult to always remember your mask and stuff, but like at the end of the day, like you still need to realize that like COVID isn't over yet. Labor Day is now only two weeks away, so the next 14 days are going to be crucial. Everyone watching the COVID numbers to see exactly which direction Broward is going to be headed for the fall. In Davie, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.